so the task is that uh, you are talking with roni's mother mira roni is a 8 year old boy and he is diagnosed case of cerebral palsy now as a doctor uh, consultant has taken the decision of a new plan to introduce gastrostomy tube roni because he pulled the ng tube and also it's really distressing for him so now you need to convince uh, mira about the gastrostomy tube uh, oh okay dr jia okay okay so you need to start uh, uh, roni mother uh, me right yes okay i'm a star so uh, good evening yeah good evening uh so this is that uh, uh, ronnie's mother yes yes okay so i have a child uh, working in this hospital uh, how are you uh, mira yeah i'm uh, fine i am here to talk with you you call me okay yeah thank you so much. so um, how is uh, how are you yeah roni is okay you know he's a cp patient and uh, what is that he's not gaining weight properly he has swallowing problem you know everything yes yes uh, so uh, do you want anyone to attend this meeting no roni's father go out so you can continue with me okay Okay, so uh, I'm here uh, to talk to you regarding a, a procedure, uh, which is uh, the gastrostomy tube procedure for Ronnie's, which have been decided by the consultant. So is is the is the right time we can talk about that? Yeah, we can. Okay, so have you ever heard of of this tube? Yeah, I've heard about. I had this word. but i have no idea what's that okay so i i'm going to tell you and if you feel in any part uh, i am not yet you can uh, interrupt me and ask okay okay mina okay so i think that we have already passed the tube through the nose in many um, uh, tummy and uh, you already know that it is not working very good with him so actually this procedure uh, get us to me to what happens is that in which we uh, the surgeon pass the tube direct to the tummy bag i make a step there yeah yeah but how can how can you do that yeah yes yes a procedure which is done the operation theater and it is uh, done under the sleep medicine in which uh, it is a small Uh, nick uh, this small um, nick has been passed on uh, on the uh, and tummy and through that a uh, uh, surgeon pass a tube directly into the tummy okay so and, it, it uh, will be workful do you think yeah yeah it's a very nice question yeah it will definitely work because uh, to that we don't need the patient we don't need the uh, person to swallow or pray with us uh, if, uh, anyone uh, any caring member can can give the fluid can give the um, thick formula through that tube it will go directly into the are you with yeah i'm with you but uh, you know the surgery is really dangerous Obex, can you repeat it? You know, every surgical procedure there are lots of drawbacks. So, what are the drawbacks about this? Yes, you are quite right. Uh, and every, uh, even us uh, carry some few uh, drawbacks, but uh, very few minor drawbacks which can happen, like uh, uh, like some sort of bleeding, some sort of infection. uh like uh, but the thing is that uh, the ratio of this uh, um, uh, side effects is very minimal and uh, it is done under the under the sleep medicine so the child can feel pain also uh, am i making myself clear 
but uh, you know it's a tube if it is obstructed like uh, it's a, then what should i do yes yes that, that's very nice concern uh, we discharge you after getting teaching from the peg nurse gastrostomy nurse uh, she'll definitely the person will definitely teach you what to do if there's any obstruction what to do if the tube has been a little bit pulled out so these instructions will be given to you by gastrostomy nurse so don't worry about that yeah, I understand that, but I feel it's really difficult for me. Uh, I think uh, I don't know how to take care of this tube. So uh, what type of feeding we can give by this? Yes, uh, very nice uh, concern. Uh, the type of the feed we are already giving through the tube which is passing through the nose, that that, uh, that all the supplements can be given through this tube. Uh, a bit thick uh, fluids can be given also. And, uh, uh, when you uh, take the shower after the surgery? Uh, you will be properly instructed. Yeah, uh, shower uh, will be allowed after a while, like after one week. Because the site where it is, uh, it will be going into the tummy uh, bag, uh, we will um, wait for a while to heal that site. Okay, okay. Uh, any other concern you have in your mind regarding the procedure? No, actually I am thinking about that. Okay, let's talk about the nurse, then I will think. Okay. Okay, so do you want Six me minutes. to summarize what we have? Uh, do you want me to summarize what we have talked till now? Yeah. So, um, for Ronnie, that has decided a procedure which is called a gastrostomy tube and the function of the, uh, the idea behind this is passing a tube directly into the tummy so that uh, so that it tolerates the feet and uh, better for his growth as well. Uh, this procedure will be done under sleep medicine and uh, there are minor of like minor bleeding and infection and sometimes uh, blocking of the tube but uh, the uh, trostium foot is to teach you about that. So I will give you some uh, websites and leaflets also regarding this uh, gastrostomy tube so that you can uh, learn more about that. Uh, so is it okay, Mira? Oh, yeah, thank you very much. Thank you, Mira. So first of all, you have remained two minutes and want to tell that you have okay. to draw the picture. You have not drawn the picture. And uh, that is a very yeah. nice picture available for this number one. Number two, at the end, you tell, ask me, do you want I summarize? No, no. Um, Ma'am, I want to summarize what we discussed today uh, for our better outcome. Okay. Like that. Yes, okay. I have to ask. And, okay. Another is, uh, you have to not told me, how can I obstruct it? Uh, just you told uh, that nurse will. Uh, you tell you how to manage it. So I'm okay. telling how can we do that? This I have this in my mind that I have I think um, we have to flush it with the uh, with water. Okay, that was not actually true. your viewers. I don't know why clearly not coming. Okay, then I'm telling how can yes, we do I that? Gastrostomy tube consent. It's very common, common exam. CP patient who pull the NG tube. That's why we are giving. So first, it is a chronic condition. The mom is uh, taking care of CP. So at the beginning, we can uh, like praise her. Mm, that is really nice. It's a great effort. You are taking care of your child like that. So first, I introduce myself. I'm who and make a report. Thank you very much for coming here. And today, I'm here to talk about our new plan of management of uh, Roni. Um, uh, is that a perfect time to you? And do I need to talk about gastrostomy tube consent? And I hope that at the end of the meeting, um, I will take the consent from you. And at the end, we have to take. So, are you agree with our plan? Here, you are taking the consent. Okay. Then, after uh, interaction, repo, permission, attendance, prior knowledge. What do you know about that? Uh, do you want anyone to join this meeting? I know you are such a keen ma'am. I know you are doing such a great effort taking care of your child. I know it is not easy to take care of a CP child. But you are doing your best. And I really admire your effort. Okay, thank you, doctor. Mom is telling. 
uh, I'm here to take you a consent from you to do a gastrostomy tube for Ronnie. What, what is that? So uh, it is a tube from the skin outside to inside the stomach through which uh, we can feed him and give him medication. So gastrostomy tube we are, we are putting from outside of the skin to direct to the stomach. We draw the pictures, then it will be easy. Okay. Uh, so it is it a surgery? Yes, it can be done either by open surgery or keyhole surgery. Uh, what is keyhole surgery? It is an endoscopic surgery. It will the surgery doctor explain. Mm, so why he need this tube? To be able to feed him and give him his medications. Uh, any alternative? Yes, alternative is NG tube, but uh, will be alternative. But yes, he's, uh, you said he pulling it out. He's not gaining weight and um, this is really distressing. That's why we are giving gastrostomy tube. Our doctor, what are the drawbacks? So drawbacks of uh, sleeping medicine like pain, bleeding and infection say the problem and solutions. But these are the temporary drawbacks and there is a risk of obstructions. These temporary drawbacks we can manage because our um, we will do this gastrostomy procedure in a clean weather um, and um, so no infection chance and also um, the doctors who are really special they have done before lots of time this gastrostomy tube placement. So there is a risk of obstruction. What happens if uh, this happens? Obstruction. First of all, you will do message of the tube between your finger. So first you will message the tube uh, between the fingers. If it did not work, you can get a 50 ml syringe and fill it with a warm water and try to push and pull technique. Then 50 ml warm water, try to push and pull technique. If it did not work, you can use the carbonated water preparation. After that, if still not work, you should seek medical advice immediately. Are you with me? Then okay, doctor. Also, there is a risk of dislodgement and if it this happened, you will to uh, put the NG tube in the opening, then go to the emergency room immediately. Am I clear? So first she will uh, message, then she will give the 50 ml warm water, push, pull and push technique. If not work, then she will use carbonated water. After that, she will go to the hospital with the emergency. Yes, doctor. It may be there is a risk of leaking, uh, uh, but we'll use skin protection, cream, and if still leaking, you should seek medical advice. Are you with me? Yes, doctor, but I do not know anything about how to take care of gastrostomy tube. You will not leave the hospital till we have a meeting with a specialized nurse who teach you everything and you should know about care of the gastrostomy tube. So in gastrostomy tube, the um, gastrostomy nurse uh, mentioning is very important. She will give the lesson. Now, how can we feed them but, or how to feed through this tube? We have two type of feedings. Continuous feeding and the bolus feeding. What is continuous feeding? Continuous by using an electrical pump, allowing certain types of food to go in the stomach over a period of time. And bolus feeding by special syringe. You will put a semi-solid fluid and you will push it through the tube and then to the stomach. What about the hydrotherapy? When the stomach is healed, he can do hydrotherapy, take shower and swimming. Uh, how can I give him tablets uh, through this tube? Tablets should be crushed and dissolved in water and after that can be given to him. So then, ma'am, uh, what is your concern? Do you have any other questions? Um, may I summarize what we discussed today? And I will give the uh, trusted website, leaflets, and the support groups. I will add in a support group so you will uh, find lots of um, patients who are using gastrostomy tube. You will learn everything. So this is all about gastrostomy tube consent. So thank you for this communication.